I knows. Three, two, one, go! Taking advantage of this. Yeah. And the downer is not gonna be able to take the stock yet. Punishing that forward smash to the back here, 129%. Will, be a will he be able to take the stock off of Eking? Right, ad ledge. Or he showed us before the ad ledge, he, he knows what to do. Yeah, and Cloud is just so good at ledge. Too. Yeah, man, he just hit him with the back air, pressing him with the blade. Beam. And the forward air, they were not able 158%. Wow, you would say that Pac Man's a heavy. <laughs> that interaction. It's not even like Pac Man, bro. E King just knows how to live. Yeah, I mean, probably, probably it's that, um, pretty, uh, what do you say, like, like stale? Mm. But Scar Fighter would be able to take the first stop. Thanks. Something I really like that Scar is doing is that, like, instead of, like, kind of trying to do, like, a shield pressure type of thing, he just kind of does one move and then waits for a, like, get out of shield option and then somehow just punishes it with something else. Uh, I mean, I mean, just it's punished off of it. It's a pretty even percent to neutral, but um, Scar could finally get that advantage off of it. I think on the ledge, missing that up beat. Finally. Oh, oh no opening for you. Never mind. Back air forward tilt is the hydrant. Okay. See the options down here. We'll be able to juggle him. Oh, okay, that, that worked. Good okay. Play yeah. To the water up the hydrant. Forward that could have maybe caught jump too. Keep oh. going what to do. Our pressure missing that. He's been punch. using a lot of apples. That's yeah, probably really good. It catches a lot of space and waves off around the Yeah, I think screen. what's good about it is it's like the speed of it specifically. And that too, the back here on the Okay, the that was really good. Really good use of you know using the blade beam to hit the hybrid and just leaving that hitbox active but like right there on one position of the stage. Yeah. Just letting it into get into a really bad spot. The back air. Blade team just trying to get that. Get that oh, the delay. delay. Dude, he's so good with his timing mix. I've noticed it all again and again. He just, every time it's a different timing. Yeah, really good for him. In the stock and having a pretty decent lead. Doubling him with the platform, sitting with the blade beam. Only 1%, basically a whole stock of advantage, and he gets with the bell All right. to an F smash saying, bro, your stock is no more. We've seen he can bring this back many, many times. No, definitely. He definitely has the skills to pick it out. Now the problem is, will that backer stuff him up enough for him to take the stock in the ledge? Missing the cross slash, up smash the hydrant, gets a grab. 137% eking and 25, 35 for Scar, 43, never mind. But still not enough. Alright. Eking pushing, gets pushing advantage or trying to at least. Smash the hydrant. Oh, and he hits a bell. Oh, oh my god, that would have been a took him for but he has a oh, he's bell dead. out of shield and he gets right. F smash right. and punished so heavily. From his very Star aggressive definitely got options, desperate there at the end. He got very desperate. Taking, taking game number one. Wow. Stock battle. Oh. Three, two. 
It's an Iki. It's an Iki. I was gonna make more versions with like other FNAF character jump scare thingies, <laughs> but I I forgot. To. I didn't make the original one though. I don't know who did, but God uh, bless that person. It was Kindred. Oh, uh, okay. I'm pretty sure it was Kindred. Anyways, back to the match. Scar with a very good um, juggling pressure. Just having it in the least of spot before the blade beam gets hit. 104 percentage. How are we already, already at this percentage, bro? It hasn't even been 40 seconds. <laughs> you are right. It's been barely 30 seconds. Having him in the ledge with the back ears, but this is the pressure. Hits another back ears, getting put back in the spot, and it's hit with that jump get up option with the back air. Starting the first stock, wasting the limit. I think something that's tough about this matchup that even though like um Pac-Man's his owner, mm -hmm. he really wants to kind of be in front of you in a way because of his abnormally stupid boxing options. But Cloud has a sword and it's just hard, it's just tough. Yeah, it's really tough for Pac-Man. Uh, besides his projectiles, he really can't do much and from what I've seen, uh, uh Cloud can eat his projectiles and the down air off stage on the ledge taking the stock and eating at an even percent. Wow. That forwarder took like five million frames <laughs> yeah. while hitting the fruit and the hydrant. And then also, like, once Pac-Man gets close, like, Cloud has a certain move that just gets him out of everything. You know what I'm noticing? Since he took, since Ige took the stop of the, wow, that, that forwarder is, has so many frames. Yeah. Um, since Ige took the stop of the downer, he's been using a lot of downer. Like, in this game alone, he's used down like four times while pressuring him. Pressuring him. So, that's a nice call to see. I think it's so that when he does up, he gets hit by like another hit, but even then, it's a sword, so it, it probably just goes through. Probably, but up smash out of shield, he can already have 2%. Just needs one back here, hitting that dash attack with the dash attack, just flying him across the stage, not being able to take the stock. Up air, but that up air is a wet noodle. Yeah. Yes. Get oh, the there you go. Right. And the help from the hydrant with the water, even though he probably did not need it. Yeah, no, he didn't need it. Oh, 61% already, somehow. Aries, the, the flying hazard that has. The landing specifically, really good. I don't know if it was on purpose. It probably was not. But probably carrying the landing. Probably was on purpose, but he doesn't get much. Because it's two hits. It's so corny. Like, the hit before it hits the ground and the hit when it hits the ground. So yeah. if you parry, like, the first hit, you'll still get hit. So good for making. King. He just wants to get a kill with the bell, but it's so hard. So, like, the pressure that Scar has is too tough. Getting hit with that up out of shield, the back air, and putting him back in the spot on the ledge. He can getting noticeably desperate. Like, yeah, you can see it here with it, like, oh! Oh, uh, missing that back air. That's gonna be pretty good punish. Alright. Alright, I have. I've noticed he uses the limit really quickly. Like, he doesn't, he doesn't take advantage of clouds, like. Speed, like, yeah. yeah. That's something I noticed too. I was gonna mention it earlier, but I yeah, forgot like, to. Like he literally has the time to waste yeah. it. And punishing that grab of a back air, Scar with the 2-0 lead. Whoa. Something that like. Oh, never mind. I'm um, with the last match, so it's a 1-1. I'm sorry. Something that like, um, Cloud just does. Sometimes Cloud's just better by just not using limit. Like yeah, just I the mean, speed works. Sometimes. Just using the speed at his advantage, that's some, you know, just pressure. Yeah. Pressure of his aerial. His aerials are just so insane. Oh. He's just running it back, you know. All players, you know? Yep. Only playing PS2. It's Smash Ultimate, baby. You love to see it. You love to see it. Nice. Starting off with the cross slash. I just, Kind of okay. He's getting punished. Yeah. Random question is, did you play Final Fantasy VII? Because you know like every name of the movie. Uh, no. Uh, I actually have it though. I have like the Switch version, which is like a port from the PS1. Oh, yeah. 
And I really want to play the remake, but I just haven't had the time. But I really love Cloud when he was released on Smash 4. Ah. Uh, I played it. It was my favorite game ever, and then I never finished it. <laughs> ever. I mean, it's an old RPG. It's kind of hard to get into. It. Yeah, I played for 10 hours in a row, and I was only halfway in a row. Yeah, they're long. They're yeah. Japanese RPGs. Yeah. So. <laughs> they RPGs are just dumb long. Like, I want to pick Dragon Quest 11, bro, and I can't play it. Mm. And the up smash take Yeah, I was going to say, speaking of long, stupid up smash. <laughs> He's a long, stupid ass Japanese mm -hmm. his dumb ass. Oh, I, I thought it was up, up smash. Wow, that is that is so insane. I can combo off those two aerials. Yeah. So good. Forwarder is like crazy stupid good. Yeah, man. Like it does everything. Does it your Do you want 40%? Forward air into side beat. True combo. Literally just 40 to 30%. Do you want to the sour spot and combo off of it? No problem. Oh, oh, that was so good. That was a hydrant off in oh. If you slightly go upwards during it, it was it was on Oh. Eric Garbo, Broco is not sleeping. He is actually TOing today. Yeah. And the back air from part of Star taking another stock. Having a very strong lead right now. Cross slash. Okay. Using another yep, cross slash. Using it instantly. Cause man, it's good. Good on shield. It is good. It does everything. It walks the dog. It does the chores. All right, nice grab. And Mario has like such insane yeah. pressure. Crazy. Oh, sour spot up air. Sour spot up air, whatever. I want you to know that I seeded Spark Bird because he's lower than Tweet in the in like the the Yo ranking. No, no, no. It's like the the rankings for like the Smash World Four. Uh huh. Tweet has more points than me. But oh. yeah, that was actually gonna put him like, like second. But like you can see like El Tapi Chan, like, he's, like yeah. he's just good. Just using like three back airs and taking off the game. And he, I think he used, did he use back air for all three stocks? I, no, no, he used his up smash for the first time. Okay, yeah, yeah. But yeah, like it's, it's dumb. It's dumb back air is dumb. Something I, I like low key, like when I say cloud back air, I just think of how you can parry that move and not punish it. <laughs> it's so dumb, like, I, I wish parrying in this game was better, cause it's it, like it could have been really cool. I'm fine with it, <laughs> personally, mm -hmm. but yeah, I can see. Do it's bad, but we got 31 viewers. Ah, oh, I thought we were saying Wario where cool, gameplay. Stop the battle. Oh. This game sucks. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, I don't know. I I, I just play Falco, bro. He just Yo, the wolf. All right. I can see that. Yo, what happened to the the E King color? The color for you. For the mixer. No, no, no. Um, it's because on XP they put his wrong colors, so he's using those colors. Like he's like the black colors. Oh yeah, I saw it. I saw that. Yeah, I saw it the other day. So, so now it's. Yeah. Anyways, um. Oh? oh okay. I literally thought he died. Time for some illegal coaching. Illegal. How, are you gonna coach him on chat? Like five seconds delayed? <laughs> no idea, but. Good back here for part of Oh, oh my god, he's what he does. Oh, okay. kill. He just wanted to trade stocks. That's insane. Dude, I. Low key, bro. He can should have lived that, bro. Bro, that was a power move. Yeah. Like that was a giga Chad move. Bro. Like I feel like, he, like Wolf is like E King's like vent character. Like <laughs> I feel like he gets so tired of waiting and playing it safe. And oh my god, that was a cross slash straight up and the back And then like 
he plays Wolf and he like I feel like every time I see him play Wolf, he, he doesn't wait. He just goes ham. He does not he doesn't want to wait. Man, this match is so explosive. Yeah, I think I'm loving these winners finals. Loki, I think Yo! it has to do do with Smash Win. Smash Bros being so small. And like, yeah, they die literally at 80% of the downside yeah. punishing the no tech situation. Also, you can just camp on PS2. Like, so hard. And it's, this, a, it's a dumb speed. Yeah. Hey, Rule's best stage, by the way. Hashtag Smashville, the best stage ever. I wish Ren was here. Dude, I am. Like, I don't know much about Ren because I'm semi new here. But like I haven't seen him anywhere. I know he's like a good wolf, but I don't ever see him. He's a great wolf. Like, yeah, he studies, you know. Ah. Uh, he got that. He got that study man. Study nerves hit like. So great. Yeah, man. He was actually gonna participate in Great Life Day, but um, he had an exam coming up, and he could like yeah. not miss the study. And is the real best player in PR? Yeah. <laughs> Dang! Oh my God! Oh, he just, he just, um, what you call that? He's like, oh, God, he oh wait, you're dead. Still yeah. taking the game. This is going to a game five situation. This is you're great. great but I Please look nice. Probably not going Smashville. No, I doubt it. What would be a good stage for Cloud? For Cloud. Honestly? Maybe Battlefield? I don't know. Battlefield, PS2. Look, Sage. Falco wouldn't play on PS2, by the way. Like, his, his worst stage. Why? He gets platform extensions and he gets to be kind of far. And I always. Yeah, but. I don't know if it's just me, but I see Larry Lure on PS2 a lot. Oh, Larry Lure plays Wolf, bro. Right. And Falco. So, um, only, only Falco wants PS2 with slower characters because uh, he can mix it up. But with faster characters, he can't play on PS2. I mean, he can't, he can't reach them. Uh, Anyways, going back to the match, Guardians goes to PS2 and he has that insane ledge pressure. It's dumb. It's very dumb. He is so good at catching people on the ledge of cloud. Right, now using the speed to his advantage, looking for some sort of opening. Yeah, he's at disadvantage, he's getting double by oh. oh, what? Bro, Edge canceling and Smash Ultra? <laughs> what was that? Um, kind of an Edge cancel, but not. Is it actually like a thing? Is that actually a thing? No, he is like, you know that moves has like auto cancel windows? Oh, right, I forgot about that. Yeah, he just yeah, 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 back yeah, yeah. into a forward air. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah. It would have been sick though. Yeah. It's good. Oh, but losing that pressure just getting him a tilt. And just getting put back at that to push it on the ledge. He does not want that. Back here. Still not it. I was Sora's Cloud. Cloud was good. I have All no right. idea. Cloud, um, Sora is a character that exists in this game. Yeah. And the up tilt even up the situation. 2v2. Are forcing Eking on ledge knowing that that's kind of where he crumbles. And where Scar reigns. They're just switching places. They're taking turns. Yeah, basically. Who goes to ledge first? I mean, they're similar characters, I would say. They both want to bash aerials, yeah. punish hard stuff. I don't know. Can use their stupid forward or the same character? Stupid forward. That's a good way to put it. Alright, back throw, yep. And yep, Go man, first. he just wastes that divot. Just straight he up. He went for it all, bro. He, like, <laughs> he lost it all. <sighs> bro, he put all of his chips in the basket and gained absolutely nothing. Missing that double jump from back air. Keeping up the pressure. And the up smash on shield. Not having crazy juggle, even in this game, the juggling is still abnormal. Yeah, I would say it's probably not better, but since like, oh, damn. Worth. that was definitely worth it. Yeah, it was worth it. Um, since Cloud has like less damage from his arrows in this game, I would say they're probably even not better. 
but it kind of gives you like more space to do. I don't know. And also, I just feel like Wolf struggles with landing. I'm talking shit about this game. I have no idea how these <laughs> characters work. Like I'm just talking like if I knew. Mm. I feel like something that's really good that he was doing earlier that he tried doing again. Is oh. that oh. That would have been sick. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. Is that he tries like like Wolf can't really land against Bob. I mean nobody Ooh. Hey, Gracie. Nobody can land against Bob, but I think Wolf struggles a little more because he's a fast baller yeah. and he doesn't have like landing options necessarily. And Cloud has stupid frame Ooh. like that. He rolled and just got punished. Oh, like, I'm not Cloud? I don't know, man. I mean, who said it? Choke? 